Wait, do the other one. Columbia. You guys, Kendall just told me the most traumatizing story. <laughs> I can't describe. <laughs> I thought that was Sharma. Oh my God, with the Sternolio triplets. That's me. I'm Nick. I'm in the back. I'm Chris. Can we read fan fiction? Matt. About I what? Action. I don't know. We should find about some. Lin Manuel Miranda. <laughs> oh my God! Wait. <laughs> wait, I'm gonna do it. I'll find it. I got it. Okay. Let me go on Ao3 I real read quick. It. I have an Ao3 work that has a bunch of views on it. The it's about field Genshin, trip. unfortunately. Raya, watch out! <laughs> Damn. Here, do you want to see? Do you want to see how many hits my yes. work has? Twenty-five thousand seven hundred twenty-eight. Bitch, you famous. Fluff, fluff and smut, smut, punishment, kink, dominant, sex, rough sex, sloppy makeup. Wait, hold on a second. Degrading. Is this going um, in the vlog? Sexual yes. tension, teasing, dirty. Oh, no left turn, no left turn. No left turn, cookie. <laughs> I hate you guys. I gotta stay strong. Oh, turn the light off. Too bright. No, one on. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> okay, just keep them on. Oh, you yawn loudly after waking up from your slumber. <laughs> you levitate out of your bed into your bathroom levitate. to get ready for the day. She's a big vocabulary. Levitate out of the bed. In the shower, you admire how hairy your legs have become. On your way out, you slip and almost fall. But to your surprise, your long brown leg hair gets caught and keeps you up. You sigh in relief. You finish getting ready by brushing your sharp teeth <laughs> and getting dressed. You wore rainbow bicycle shorts and a purple shirt that went down to the middle of your shorts. You smirked at yourself in the mirror, mesmerized by your stunning looks. When you get to your office, you hear a loud bang. Oh, what was that? You say to your shocked self. You walk over to where the noise was coming from. You couldn't believe your eyes. Child, how could you? You yell out after seeing him kill all of your co-workers. He, lo <laughs> he looks your way and gives a sly smirk. He starts doing cartwheels your way. You walk backwards trying, <laughs> you walk backwards trying to get as far away from him as possible. But soon enough, you hit a wall. Shit, you think in your mind. What are you supposed to do? What a surprise, child said with a psychotic laugh. Please, child, I don't know what your reasons are for this, but I promise I won't tell anyone if you let me go. Please, you beg on your knees as hard as you can with tears welling up. Well, I guess that can work, child says, still with his smirk. But you're gonna need a punishment for me to trust oh, you. Oh no! What? You were terrified. You begged for him not to, but it was too late. His decision was already made. Now then, follow me, child commanded. Phone's frozen. Unwillingly, you followed him to a yellow door. He opened the door, creaking loudly. He pushes you in. You fall to the hard floor, hurting your butt. Ouch, you whimper while rubbing your backside. He's amused by your reaction. He slams the door closed while walking in. Christian Grey. Now, to start your punish punishment, he laughs out. Your heart is beating fast. You have no clue what he'll do to torture you. Soon enough, he starts. He uses his hydro vision to fill the room with water. The room is filling quickly. The water keeps rising. It soon goes above your head. You try to swim up, but your leg hair is weighing you down. <laughs> you struggle for a while, kicking and flailing your limbs until you fall unconscious. Once Child sees you unconscious, he opens the door and lets the water flow out of the room. He comes over to your unconscious body, examining it. To save you from death, he decides to remove the water from your lungs. Child finds a bucket from another room and brings it over. He opens your mouth as wide as it can go. He climbs into your mouth with the bucket, slipping down into your body. <laughs> Once he reaches your lungs, he puts all of the water into the bucket and finds his way out. <coughs> you cough out. <laughs> I thought that was real. <laughs> You're such a good actor. Why did you do that? You screamed angrily. It was just your punishment, sweetheart, he replied with a sweet yet unapologetic smile. So you'll let me be free now, you question while being hopeful. He licks your eyes and your toes in response. <laughs> Kendall, you toes? <laughs> Why not the hairy legs? <laughs> of course, he says with a wink. When you get up to leave, 
He pulls you back down by your leg hair. <laughs> You're in shock. What will he do now? You can't even think of what else he can do to make it worse. Go let him shave but my leg hair. You are now my pet. He says as he turns you into a cat. What? You scream for him to turn you back, but all that comes out are harsh meows. No. Good kitty, he praises you no. while patting your head. He picks you up and takes you to his house. For the rest he of your life, cat? you live as child's cat. The end. You know who should read that? Miss Wright. Sharma. <laughs> Someone said, this was so emotional. Hashtag coming. Hashtag hot. I came 30,000 times. You portrayed child perfectly. I wouldn't have been surprised if this was an actual scene from the game. Thank you for writing such a masterpiece. I truly applaud your skill and creativity. We're so sexy. I came a million times. We're so this. sexy. Hashtag ball sack. Hashtag wop. <laughs> Someone said, thanks for this masterpiece. Please do more uwu. <laughs> Does this count as vor? <laughs> Decide how you just gave me. Kendall, get out of that comment section. <laughs> I thought you were going to say, Kendall, get out of the car. <laughs> this is the best too. thing I've read in months. <laughs> Who are these children? They must be children. I love my long hairy legs and how they're a constant hindrance. Well, at least they are pretty. What? Search up Lin no, no more Miranda <laughs> fanfiction and I want to read one. I, got you, I, got you. I want to read one. What did you say earlier? Colo Colombia. Colombia. Yeah, that. Me encanto. <laughs> I still <laughs> haven't seen that movie. Don't watch it. Yeah. It's not worth it. Okay, everyone. There were many things in your life that you were grateful for. Your dream job, a beautiful home, and a beautiful family. But nothing could ever compare to how grateful you were for Lynn. <laughs> it had been a week long for you, but you were happy to finally be going home and into the weekend. Lynn knew you had a rough week, so he told you that he wanted to do something special for you. But he wouldn't tell you what, no matter how many times you asked. He was a romantic and he always found new ways to make your heart flutter and show you how much he loved you. Even now, after 10 years of marriage and 15 years of being together in total, you find yourself falling deeper and deeper in love with him every single day. It's rare. <laughs> Wait, hold on. When you finally made it home, you were greeted with Lynn standing in the entryway of your apartment, a bouquet of roses in his hand. Lynn Manuel, <laughs> what is <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> he replied like, with the most adorable smile on his face, one that made your heart do somersaults. They spelled somersaults wrong. Summer. Summer. You said you had a rough week, so I wanted to do something for you. I figured that after 15 years, I'd become a decent enough cook, so I made you dinner. Smiling back at him, you pulled him in for a heart-melting kiss as you felt him pull you close to him, yeah. his hands resting politely on your hips. You know how hard it was watching <laughs> Hamilton, like with Lynn, like kissing, kissing all Eliza, these women? Yeah. I felt bad. He's probably like slobbered all over them. When you yeah. pulled apart, you almost <laughs> melted into him as he looked at you with the most beautiful look you had ever seen. His eyes always told you everything you needed to know about how he felt about you, for he always looked at you as if you were the only person in the world. Aww. Aww. You would be yeah. lying if you said that his eyes were one of the biggest things about him that made you fall from his dick. So not his dick. <laughs> come on. Come sit. I've got some wine and I picked out a movie for us to watch after we eat. You're too damn sweet, Lynn. You didn't have to do that. Wait, where are the kids? <laughs> we have kids with Lynn. Can you imagine little Linians? Linians? Linian minions. Linian minions. <laughs> little Linians running around. They're with my parents. I told them about what I was doing and they offered to watch them for the weekend so we can spend some time together. Oh, security. You need to... Are they gonna yell? 
No. Okay. <laughs> Continue. <laughs> <laughs> if they find out what we're doing here. <laughs> Sir, do you want to hear the story? <laughs> there was a hint of mischief behind his tone, and you had a feeling that tonight would end with the two of you tangled in the sheets. Oh, <laughs> baby. <laughs> another baby. Come but in. you didn't want to rush anything. You're married. Being in his presence was more than enough for you. Dinner was everything. <laughs> his cooking skills had definitely improved over the years. As you both finished, much to your protest, Lynn grabbed your plates and washed the dishes. I thought you were going <laughs> to grab your pussy. <laughs> Damn, that moved a little fast. <laughs> Refilling both of your glasses of wine, you took this moment to get a good look at him, trailing your eyes up and down his frame. <laughs> He was dressed in a plain black v-neck and some jeans. Nothing Ew. too special, but something about it was so undeniably sexy. His short, dark hair was styled neatly. His beard's life but still present. He was gorgeous, and you were so lucky to call him yours. Did I mention that you look insanely handsome tonight? <laughs> mm, I don't think so. <laughs> Well, well, you do. That v-neck looks so fucking good on you. Oh yeah, he said. Playful oh, smirk. Oh god. I need to have a conversation with whoever wrote this. <laughs> there needs to be an intervention. You need help. As he leaned against the kitchen island, reaching around his body to put down his glass of wine, his eyes never leaving yours as you walked towards him. Oh no. You know what else looks good on me? What's that? You. I'm gonna start crying. You. There's like ten yous. You. <laughs> you both laughed, but you had to agree with him. When you made it over to him, you felt him move to pull you between his legs. Oh my god, pressing you against him. He moved your own hands to his face, gently running a single thumb across his gorgeous lips <laughs> before trailing your. I'm acting it up. your fingers down, resting your hands on his chest as he moved his own hands to your ass. I knew you planned everything out, but what did what do you say we skip the movie? Ooh. You took the words right out of my mouth, princess. <laughs> Not the princess. It gets worse. I skipped out a little yeah, bit. I, I'm knowing. She called him Poppy. <laughs> <laughs> Colombia! <laughs> <laughs> Lynn finally leaned in a cap leaned in a captured your lips in a heated kiss, opening his mouth and swiping his tongues against your lips, begging for you to let him in. You already you were already soaking wet. In front of him. No, it's Okay, this is where we stop. No, 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 we need to keep going. Baby, what are you? Oh, oh fuck. <laughs> What? <laughs> Lynn moaned above you, his fingers tangling themselves in your hair as he guided your movements, his <laughs> other hand holding onto the counter for balance. Oh shit, mi amor. Baby, wait. What's wrong? Nothing. I'd just rather. Oh my god, I'd just much rather. F wouldn't you? That's where we ended it. <laughs> no, please. We need to know what happens next. <laughs> Part two. <laughs> Guys, the real question is how big? Is two inches. Do you think he has nude somewhere? No. Me encanto. <laughs> Colombia. Colombia. Don't worry, I'll keep the tab open. We'll get an ending. Look at that car. Damn. I we'll wanted to a tree. I know, I was thinking. <laughs> I guess you guys just like dancers. No, I just like Asians. I demolished a Big Mac before I could start filming. Trump. <laughs> This is the best sauce. <laughs> I'd be saying this randomly now, like. How dare you, Mr. Spears? You had copyright. And you too, Mrs. Spears. Death to all of them. This is my favorite saying in the world. Oh my god! You know, today people didn't know that like you can put your hands like you know how it's warm in your boobs, and like if it's cold and you do that, like your hands will warm up. Yeah. You know, Gwen know. and them didn't know that until I said something and then they all tried it and they're like, oh, what the fuck? And I was like, you don't like put your hands in there like 
like it's like a comfort thing for me too like i just oh yeah i just have my head like this and like i'm on my phone like in bed though. is this all going in the video sure <laughs> <laughs> i really don't care <laughs>